Timur Wilderness is sort of hyper artificial glowing neon jungle and the flowers inside this jungle respond to sound so if you make uh, a noise over different frequencies they will close up and hide away because they're scared especially of humans. I've been researching a lot into symbiosis with uh, flowers and pollinators and something that really stuck with me was that in pollinating insects can see in UV wavelengths, which we can't. And um, the flowers have actually co-evolved with the insects to have these crazy patterns on them. And I sort of imagine this space here to be some strange jungle that has um, how flowers have evolved and how the climate has devolved because of climate change. But then at the same time, definitely grounding them and not trying to look naturalistic. They do in a way, but they also definitely are made out of plastic bottles and string and bits of elastic, which is important for me. I collect a lot of waste things, so all of the wood was also scrap. This is actually my first uh, project using microcontrollers. Martin developed the artificial intelligence and the electronics. I'm basically making these kind of like auditory nerves, so it's got like a, a microphone on one side and a motor on the other side and depending on what it hears it will respond in different ways. I think we as humans tend to forget how supernatural the natural really is. And so I really like to highlight, sort of bring back some magic into the way we see the world because there is a lot of magic, but we somehow forget it. Capitaine Futur.